Welcome to Technical Studies. Today, I will show you how to mark the centerline of A, reducing T. Let us check the squareness of the T. Hold the right angle on the large face of the T, as shown. Slowly, move the right angle towards the smaller side. If the right angle leg touches both edges of the opening, we can assume the squareness is correct. Check on both ends of the T. If the reducer is too large, use this method. Hold a large right angle on the large face. Hold another right angle on the smaller face, as shown. If the legs of both right angles are parallel, we can assume both openings are in right angle to each other. Put the T on a level plate and level the top side. Put packing on both sides. Check the outer diameter of the T. Mark half OD of the pipe on a right angle inner side. Since the diameter of this T is 386 millimeters, I am going to mark 193 millimeters here. Mark 193 millimeters on the other leg of the right angle. Hold a right angle on the T as shown. Put a level bottle on the top of the right angle and level it. Transfer the half OD mark on the pipe, on the top, and the side. Repeat the marking on the other end of the T. Put the right angle on the other side and mark the center. Hold a right angle matching the top marking and transit the center to the bottom inside. Later you can transfer this marking to the outer side. Hold a right angle on the top side as shown. Rotate and adjust one leg of the right angle to make it parallel to the side of the T. Move the right angle slowly to the center of the branch. Mark lines on both edges. Hope you know how to mark the other quarter center lines. Let us learn another method. Put the T on horizontal position and correct the squareness. Put proper packing.
Hold a right angle, as shown. Move the right angle, until to the center of the branch. Mark lines, on the top and the bottom sides. Thank you for watching. Please comment.